Hey, hello everybody. Welcome back to the Nocturnal Gaming Network. My name is Zira, and today we are back playing Red Dead Redemption. We have just come back from rescuing our Irish friend from Blackwater, and we have gained ourselves a nice $120 bounty in this province here, and I'm not sure what to do about that. I do know that we have a companion right here. And, you know, while everybody is sort of off partying in the camp, we're going to take a quick trip out there. We're going to get our shotgun ready. Oh, we're going to press the right button here, please. Really wish I knew how to use this. There we go, shotgun. All right, and we're going to ride out and see what's going on with this person, this random companion in the woods outside of camp. I don't know if it means we're going to gain a companion, or lose a companion, or what. They're right along this track somewhere. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Hmm. It's disappeared. Huh. Okay. It was on the map. I don't know where it went. It's right away. We should probably rest our horse for a little while, though. See if it's back. Nope, it's not back. All right. Whatever. We're gonna park. There you go. Park Shadow Facts. Right there. And we'll head into our into our tent. Yeah, it's still not there. Okay. And I think we need to sleep until morning. Maybe that'll make the companion come out. Oh, this isn't my tent. Where am I going? <clears throat> I don't know where I'm going. Here's our tent. Uh, sleep. Alright, we're gonna sleep until morning. Nice seven hours of rest. Just what we need. Such a pretty sky. Alright, so it looks like everything is back to normal now. We have no companion. No strangers. No nothing. So what do we want to do today? I think the first thing we gotta do is go grab that deer that we left sitting on the ground outside over here somewhere. What is that target? There's the deer. Companion. What's this? Oh, we can go hunting with Charles. Huh. Maybe we should do that. Here's the deer. Rotten white-tailed buck. Okay. I guess we're just gonna leave that thing right there and, uh... <laughs> hope it doesn't offend the horses too much. But, uh, we get the opportunity to go hunting with Charles, so let's do that. That sounds like fun. Hey, Charles, what's up? What you prepare for? The greatest of gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. <laughs> no, you simple-minded fool. Bison. <laughs> Bison? Bison? Bison. How much you can get anything. There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Good luck. You want to come with me? 
I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? So how do we hunt one? Mount up then. Let's go. All right, Charles. Good one, boy. You know, I don't I don't know if I have a weapon powerful enough to kill a bison. My time, of course, but my mother used to tell me stories of how her tribe moved with the bison. They hmm. lived almost as one. The bison went, my people went. They were the center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything. Food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much of my childhood. But I think my people, well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> well, my father did that too. Let's try over here to the left. Ooh, there's Over some bison. There. You see them all? Incredible, aren't they? We should only kill one of them. I'll oh. keep them ringed in okay. and see if you can bring one down. Okay? Clean as you can. Okay. Alright, so how how am I even gonna do this? Um Probably a pump action shotgun is <laughs> my my best uh best way to get these things. Let's see. Nice big bison here. Right here. This one. Uh oh. Hi there, pal. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's not what I want to do. and butcher it. Take the horns, too. It can all be used. Okay. So, let's skin it. You're all right, boy. Hold on. Hmm. Quite detailed, huh? Good job. Stow that on your horse and mount up. I wanna go check something out. Okay, let's go. Is that it? Or we we can't just leave this thing here? Really? That's it? Okay. Where I guess we going? we're gonna I mount up. I saw some scavenger birds over here. Just wanted to see what attracted them. Let's just get our shotgun ready. Oh dear. No. Look. Bison. Shot and left for dead, it looks like. Why would someone do that? I don't know. But I see tracks heading in this direction. I say we follow him. Alright. Lead the way. All right, Charles. We will we will get to the bottom of this. Find out who's butchered these bison, or not butchered them. Just just sort of left them. Oh, they've been shot. I just don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that. Look, another dead bison on the hill to the right. Come on. Where? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. I see it. Shot and left for dead again. But this one looks fresher. There's a camp there. I'm gonna take a look. Hmm. So there's still coals in the fire. Alright. Oh, it's haven't gone cold yet. Maybe half a day since they left. 
Bison's been dead about the same amount of time. So what do you want to do? They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher. See if we spot anything. All right. This way. We should have a good view from up here. Okay. You see anything? I see fire. Arthur, look. Smoke to the north. Could be another camp. Let's go check it out. Bastards. Killing for fun. You think we can talk? I don't kill for fun. I kill when I need to. Uh oh, what are you what are you doing? Just ride right into the rocks. Alright, get my shotgun ready. Look, more dead bison. It has to be that. Come on. Wait up. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Hold on. Don't do this, man. Don't go riding off. Did you fools shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said. Did you fools shoot those bison? Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the fuck you are. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What? We. <laughs> it's that business of mine! Good God, you're crazy! I got a family. A family. Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Well, apparently we're going to beat him. Killing those bison and leaving them to rot. I don't know what you're talking about. No. God damn it, tell us you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could and make it look like it was Indians. Just kill him, Arthur. No. Please, don't kill me. I'm begging you. Mm. I've heard enough. Charles really wants this guy dead. Damn right. That's what he deserved. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. I'm gonna see if there's anything worth taking from their camp. I'll catch up Cover with you scent, huh? Loot the poacher's camp. What do we got here? What's in the tin? Some sweet rolls? No. Horse Reviver. Okay. Can't take any more of whatever that item is. What's in here? Anything in here? No. Oh! I didn't see this the first time. Lockbox. Uh -huh. Poison throwing knife pamphlet? Poison throwing knives. Okay. So what do we need? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. What's this hat? Oh. I don't want that. Can I take this buffalo skin hat? Oh, it's a bear skin hat. <laughs> oh. All right, I'm going to put this thing back. I think we would uh, attract the wrong kind of attention walking into Valentine or somewhere with that thing on. All right, yep. speaking of that, we should head into Valentine now that we've got some bison to sell. And then we should probably stop at the general store, too. I feel like... Um, that would be... What's going on? Oh, okay. 
Yeah, no, I don't wanna... I don't wanna deal with the law right now. I have a hard enough time with them even when I'm not causing problems. So let's just, uh, leave them alone, and we'll head over here. To Valentine. What's this guy? This guy looks like he's not doing too good. Help me, please, kind sir. What are we doing? Please, someone show kindness on a man with no sight. What are you doing? Help the blind. Earn your fortune. Oh, Maybe don't, no, 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 put, put that away. Maybe today is the beginning of the end. Beginning of the end. I'd give him a dollar. Help a blind man. Why can't I give him a dollar? Yeah. Negative one dollar, okay. Make your final moments your best moments, sir. No glory and forget about shame. All right, friend. My final moments, huh? You better not shoot me as I ride away. I gave you a dollar. <laughs> hey, I think we're back into the positive karma now. That's good. Ooh. I wonder if I can capture this thing and like, bring it in. Ain't no thing. Get it, Arthur. Now that, it. Now that's enough now. I don't think it's getting calmer. Easy. Easy, Arthur. You're gonna get kicked in the head. Let's mount the horse. Okay. Hey now. Easy. Oh boy. Easy. Oh no. <laughs> this is the wrong time to be. Okay, come on, horse. Come on, horse. Come on. Oh no. Okay. We got some O'Driscolls after us! Please don't shoot my horse in the head. Oh! Okay. 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 Whew. Now we need to we need to get off the tracks. Alright, alright. So we go. there we go. There we go. Stay right there. Okay. I feel like I probably shouldn't just leave that horse alone. It's probably gonna run away from me. Five dollars? That was well worth it. Where'd that other horse go? That other horse is over there. Any other bodies? I don't see any other bodies. Okay. So, let's get on our horse. Let's get the lasso out. Whoa. Slow down there. Oh. Alright, alright. Let's get on this horse. And have my horse following me. Come on, horse. Come on, Shadowfax. I wonder if I can sell this horse that I just grabbed.
Hey, a fox. Oh, I just stepped on it. That's not quite what I intended to do. Yeah. All right. So we are in Valentine. I have bonded with the horse. Okay. That's that's good, I guess. I don't really want to bond with it. I sort of just want to take it and sell it. Whoa there. I think my horse. <laughs> I think Shadowfax is causing chaos back there, like running people over and stuff. I hope I don't get in trouble if he runs people over. Hi everyone. Pay no attention to me. Getting quick, folks, before I eat all these chops myself. Alright, so we want to remove the bison pelt. Poor bison pelt. Oh no. Looking to ship the pelt you got there? Let's sell it. Hello. Bison horn. 82 cents. Prime bison. Bison? Bison? Phew. What else do you want to sell? Buck antlers? Matured venison meat. Alright. Alright, girl. Let's take this thing, this brand new horse we caught, into the stable. You almost killed me! I did not. You're fine. Alright. Two dollars, that's it. Stable if you need it. Nah, I'm here to sell. Alright. If you ain't got the papers, I can't give you the full price. What do you mean, got the papers? I just went out into the wilderness and caught it. I don't know whose horse it was, but it's mine now. Alright. General store. Hi. Emerson's herd that died. Heard you done poison. enough harm well, here. Why doesn't that surprise me none? People don't like me. I don't know why they don't like me. I'm such a nice person. Got everything you need. Have a look. I'm I'm here to sell actually. Sure, I'm always willing to stock up. All right, apple. We can Let's see. Horse reviver. Let's right. get rid of one of those. Peaches. Let's get rid of some peaches and some carrots and coffee. Don't really need it, but why not? Okay. Fine brandy. Okay then. Huh. Sell a little mm -hmm. bit of everything. Okay. Cool. Now, going to buy well, stuff here. Fighting's my load. We want to browse the catalog. Oh, Alright. Uh, hunting and fishing. Let's see what's going on here. We can get some arrows, some bait. Worms. A coffee percolator? Hmm. A pocket watch. I get all kinds of coots come in here. That's something. Uh. Hmm. All right. We don't really need anything here. View. Those go pretty fast. Oh, yeah? How come you don't have any dusters in black? Classic tailcoat. That's mighty popular these days. Is it now? Classic frock. A scout jacket. Shotgun coat. 
Rambler jacket. What's this? Hmm. I don't like these color selections. Careful playing cards in this town. Some real cheaters around here. Cheaters, huh? Well, then. We'll have to take care of them. Our special attention to boys and gentlemen's Seem hosiery. a bit taken with that. All right. Ooh, look at these boots. I sell out of that pretty fast. I'll bet you do. Hmm. Deluxe quick draw boots. Plated, huh? Grinder boots. Cavalry boots. Classic preacher's boots. English. Used to hack up Citadel Rock all the time when I was younger. Just don't have the energy no more. No. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at that. That black and red is nice. Half chaps. Feller was telling me the daughter at Emerald Ranch don't leave the house no more. Been locked in up there for a couple years now. Really? Well, thank All you right. so much for about. your um, information here. Cheese wedges. Chocolate bar. Interesting. Alright. You got a problem there? Welcome back. No problem. I feel like I want this wagon. I think we're gonna do it. Once we get out of town and there's no witnesses, we're going to take this wagon from this person and we're going to fence it and see what we can get. I wonder what's in the wagon. Be very, very quiet, Arthur. Don't get into any trouble whatsoever. Yeah. We're just waiting for this wagon. <laughs> That's it. Nothing else. Ooh, actually, that looks like a nicer wagon. Right up there. I'm going after this one. Nice big horses there, too, huh? The question is, how do we... How do we separate them? I can jump to the wagon. I feel like we're going to need to take out both of these people. Let's... Oh, I lost my hat. Hmm. Alright, pump action shotgun. We're a decent way away from the town now. All 
right. Cool. Now we need to stop the wagons. Alright. Alright, let's jump to this wagon. Okay. We need to get out of here real quick. Like. Hi there. Excuse me. All right. It's that simple. All right, let's let's wait right here. What we need to do is get our big face mask off. How do I do this? Yeah, no, I, I want to take it off, please, Arthur. Release LB to remove. There we go. All right, and now I want my, ho my hat back. Good. And we get back up on the wagon and make our way to our fence in the Emerald Ranch, which is, which is right over there. So I wanna be following this road, right? Is that this the road? Yes, I follow this road and I eventually make it there. Okay. Come horse. All right, these horses don't seem to have too much stamina issues. Like they can just go for an infamin, infinite amount of time. I hope this guy doesn't doesn't say anything. Oh, oh, excuse me, excuse me, sorry. Ugh. Oh, we have a random deer on the side of the road. And a bird just flew into the side of our wagon. How wonderful. <laughs> this is awful. We just ran over a rabbit. Oh. This fence guy is way out here, huh? Oh, we got a camp. Steer clear of the camp. Where are we going? We're basically going around this road, and the next time we get to a big triangular intersection. Okay. Hey, this is starting to look familiar. Trapped. What happened? My horse collapsed. I, I, I don't know why. It's my friends. I'll see what I can do. Repeatedly <gasps> press A to lift the horse. Just lift as hard as you can. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You saved me. Sure. Oh, that was bad. Okay. Sure. Okay. You're okay now? I've been stuck here and starved or eaten. Oh, you poor, dumb animal. Well, good oh. luck then. What'll I tell Mildred? <laughs> tell him you're. You're welcome, stranger. Good luck. See, I'm not as bad as I seem with my bandana and stealing carriages and such. Alright. 
so I need to keep going here. Because that, yeah, there it is. That's where I'm going. There we go. Right around the corner like this. And here we are at the fence's house. Oh. I think there was a casualty. He was ready for me. That's awesome. Perfect timing, man. I'm parking it. I think I busted a wheel when I hit that rabbit or something. Oh, you might be interested in this. Well, ain't this a lovely little thing? Deal. Don't spend it all at once. I'll try not to. How much you give me? Do we get to negotiate this? Forty dollars? Ha ha. Alright, Seamus. Are you you ain't oh. nobody. Sorry, Seamus. Okay. I cannot use this. What? She Seamus, I want to sell more stuff to you. Alright. Oh, so big man. sorry, Seamus. <laughs> Alright, so $40 for a wagon. We could. At this rate, steal a couple more, <laughs> a couple more wagons, and then be uh, pretty well on our way to uh, to paying for our bounty in that other town, paying the one hundred and twenty dollar bounty. That is, yeah. I don't know if we really need to pay the bounty or not. I mean, I'm sure we're going to be there at some point, so. It might be better if we pay it uh, sooner rather than later, but you know. Let's get some meat to take home with us. Hi there, Mr. Deer. Where'd you go? Here it is. I wonder if I can... Got it. Good. I... This probably isn't the smartest thing we've ever done, but, you know. Is it gonna gore me? It's okay. Ooh. Survival points. Hmm. There we go. Whitetail Buck. This one better be in pristine condition here. Stow it on the horse. Good. And then we can check... Oh, not our satchel. Check the horse cargo. We have a good... Displaying minor damage? I don't understand. I get up really close to it and slit its throat. How is it damaged? Oh, well. Off we go into the sunset. We need to deliver this buck to our camp so we can eat tonight. I don't know what they're doing with all these deer. I mean, there are a good amount of them, I suppose, but I seriously bring them home a new deer every single day, and they're still like, Oh, we're out of food! Gee, maybe some other people should... So many dead animals. Maybe some other people should hunt besides us, hmm? I think that's what should happen. Yep, more people should hunt. Where am I going? I need to... Follow... Ah, I can just follow the road. Okay, good. That'll take me right where I need to be. Howdy, stranger. I can jump to his horse. And throw him off of it, probably? Yeah. Yeah, good boy. 
Alright! Almost back in camp. We're low on stamina, though, so we probably want to be gentle with our horse from this point out. Hey, Javier! How are you, man? Oh, okay. Don't, don't talk to us, then. I'm coming in! Okay, we did greet him. So, supplies. Where am I going? Camp funds, $41. Awesome. We're coming up in the world. So let's put our horse away. Come on. Get, get, there we go. I think, I think you're stabled properly, I'm not sure. All right. Let's brush Shadow Facts real quick. Oh, we forgot to get oat cakes for our horse. Get you looking nice. Yeah, get him looking nice. Brush him, get him all clean. Nice, sleek coat. Awesome. All right, and Let's get you cleaned up. perfect. Let's feed him for the day. There you go, Shadow Facts. Yeah, you're a good horse, aren't you? Now we need to remove the deer. And hopefully the party's over, because, you know, last time we brought a deer home, they were partying and they didn't want anything to do with it, so we sort of left it out in the bushes to rot. Yeah. Alright. Don't fight other man's battles, boy. And anyway, my family weren't even English. <laughs> Whatever you say, King Arthur. <laughs> King Arthur. I like that. All right. Cover scent lotion reduces animal detection. All right. Let's donate this to Look, provisions. Really needed this. Yeah. Good. I'm glad. Thanks, You're welcome. And we should probably. should probably contribute a little bit more to the pot here too. What do we what do we have for items? Platinum pocket watch. Let's get rid of this. And a gold pocket watch. There we go. Yeah, platinum band. A gold plated belt buckle. All right. Perfect. All right, so that's it. I think we're good for now. Um, so next time when we return, we have a couple missions to do. We've got Uncle. We have to talk to him. We have to talk to Thomas Downs. And we have to talk to Dutch right there. Next time, we're probably going to, I would say, talk to either Uncle or Dutch, but, you know, we'll figure it out. Until then, we will sleep. Or do we need to shave? We don't need to shave yet. Yeah, we're doing good. All right. <laughs> Swanson, really? How do I sleep? There we go. All right. Thank you all so much for watching. My name's Zira, and this is the Nocturnal Gaming Network, bringing you Red Dead Redemption 2. Have yourselves a wonderful night, everybody.